Welcome to Celebrating Act 2. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life. Welcome to Celebrating Act 2. Today, John Coleman and I have a very special guest who is just a delight. John, tell us a little bit well, about our Art, guest. thank you. I, I, I appreciate the privilege of the introduction. Um, she is a special guest, and she is delightful, but you know that because you are old friends with our guest. I'm going to meet her for the first time, and I'm looking forward to it because she is the CEO of a wonderful charity. It's a very kind of specialized charity. It's called Working Wardrobes, and it helps people get back into the workforce, primarily by giving them clothes. You know, you've been out of the workforce. You come in for a job interview, and you look like you're 10 years out of date. It makes it harder to get a job. So they service, of course, seniors. That's what we're interested in with Celebrating Act Two. anybody over 50. But they service um, clients of all kinds of walks of life, I guess. We'll find out about that. Let's meet the CEO of Working Wardrobes, Bonnie Palmish. Bonnie, welcome to Celebrating Act Two. Hey, Bonnie. Hello. Hi, Art. So good to see you, John. So nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So, Bonnie, um, I stumbled there trying to figure out how to say the the broad array of people that you uh, that you have as clients. Explain what you do, because uh, it is a specialized service, uh, uh, but you also serve a broad. Am I getting this? I'm getting more confused as I. It's your turn, Bonnie. <laughs> <laughs> John, we do. We help women, men, veterans, youth, seniors. We will really help anyone who is overcoming a barrier to get back into the workforce. Our mission is really oriented around rebuilding careers, and we do that in a very individualized way. People come to us with, like you said, a real every walk of life, every kind of experience you can imagine, just like all of us humans are, right? Completely unique beings. And we have job coaches who will identify with that person. What are the skills and talents they come to the table with? What are the goals that they are aiming to achieve? And let's create, we create a individualized plan to get them there. That can include getting certifications or job training. It could include learning how to use a computer or some of the new platforms that we've become accustomed to through the pandemic. It could be getting forklift certification. It could be a lot of different things. So it just really depends on what the client's aiming to achieve and we will help them get there. Once they have literally transformed on the inside, meaning they have obtained the skills that they need to uh, you know, achieve that goal, we help them with job searches and, of course, resume preparation, interview preparation, the full cadre of services needed. And once they have received that first interview, we do the cherry on top, which is wardrobing, like you mentioned. We then get them styled up in a success suit so that their outsides match the updated inside. So you... That's you. Uh... Uh, well, working wardrobes uh, with an S uh, is a, um, uh, it, it sounds as if you just give clothing. You do so much more than that. You basically will uh, help people uh, get ready for the interview process. And as you say, upgrade skills and so on and so forth. So, but you obviously take donation of clothing, but you also take donations of people, time, trainers, and uh, 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 corporate uh, um uh, contributors as well who may be able to help you on a, a grander scale, even perhaps provide uh, job interviews and things like that. Where sh should people go if they want to find out more about you or contribute? Oh, thank you for asking. Our website is a great first stop, workingwardrobes.org. You are always welcome to call us. Our phone number is 714-210-2462. Again, it's 714-210-2460. And you said it really well, Art. I, I really have yet to meet a person that doesn't have a connection or a way to contribute to this work. 
it could be, like you mentioned, a corporation that we're partnering with to provide jobs and sometimes even the skill training to enter that job. We partner with corporations, obviously, in the financial sense, and that is a huge supporter of working wardrobes and our ability to say yes to every client that comes in the door. Individuals, absolutely. Oh, individuals and corporations really can support us through clothing donations. Sometimes that looks like holding a clothing drive at the office and everyone brings their clothing, their clean contributions on a hanger and lay them on the rack and then someone brings them over to our donation center or an individual can pull up the car with those clothes on the hanger. Um, Tuesdays through Saturdays from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. we accept donations on Daimler Street in Irvine. And yes, absolutely, the, the time and the ability to volunteer one's skills and talents is an absolute treasure to working wardrobes as well. And that can be in a lot of aspects. We always need help sorting and quality checking clothes at the donation center, working with clients to help them update their resume, prepare for the interview, to you know make that roadmap from where they are to where they're going. We have volunteers who help us regularly with that personal shopping and helping a person you know get that success suit on. We have volunteers who help us in our retail stores, which is our social enterprise, I'll talk a little bit more about that, um, the people who are able to help keep those racks full and the, the items on them rotated and to help customers just like you would in any store. The difference, of course, in our stores is that we're not raising money to make more money. We're raising money to fund our mission, which means you're shopping for a cause by um, being, you know, being a customer of the hangar, we have four of those retail stores, uh, two are boutique style and two are outlets. And just like it sounds, our boutiques are our higher end luxury brands and our outlets are everyday wear. Um, but you could volunteer in any capacity, really, at Working Wardrobes and make a difference in a client's life. Mm. Bonnie, this is a, a a wonderful, wonderful charity you guys have put together. It's been around for 30 years, as I understand it. But I, I'm particularly impressed by your your phrase on the website that you have called, it says, the power of the paycheck. And I think that nails it because it's not just a job. It's It's the power you're bringing to people's lives. You're absolutely right, John. This is also the power that one person make a difference. Jerry Rosen in 1990, our founder, created Working Wardrobes out of the desire to help some women who experienced and survived a domestic violence situation have a, a day of self-esteem, an opportunity to build their confidence and give them um, a moment to recreate themselves and to see themselves hopefully in a different light. And we have continued that work now for over 31 years. The power of one person to make a difference, like Jerry Rosen did, has now helped over 114,000 people experience that power. And that, that trademark tagline, right, the power of a paycheck, really embodies what it is that we're aiming for. And that is true empowerment. We empower people to be able to help themselves. And we do that with a lot of love and care. One of my favorite quotes from a client was, I went to a government office and got help, but when I came to working wardrobes, I got help with love. So we give our clients that love and that, that treasure of an individual plan, and we are aiming to help them experience true empowerment, that they can make different choices by earning that, that power of a paycheck. Right. That's, right. that's wonderful. By the way, we're going to um, uh, put a, uh, the information about contacting Working Wardrobes that you gave us just before uh, in uh, below the uh, uh, video here. But um, uh, so anybody who is either is a potential client or can donate time or money uh, yep. can use that to contact you. But I encourage them to go to your uh, website, Working Wardrobes with an S dot org. And take a look, uh, because as John was saying, I was so impressed with uh, the power of a paycheck and a lot of people who are talking about their first job 
Uh, it reminded me back when I was in high school delivering uh, tile, uh, these heavy boxes of tile. I was just uh, walking back and forth and and uh, grunting and carrying stuff up a couple of floors, but I got a paycheck out of it and uh, it was yeah. terrific. So, What was uh, your first paycheck story, John? I love art. Yeah, what's your story, John? Do you have a story? Uh, uh, no, I refuse to do a, a story. But I, I will say that it is, there is nothing like earning, uh, earning your own keep, if you will. It's a, it's a wonderful feeling, so. And I wish that for everybody who, who needs it. And Bonnie, thank you so much for, for uh, not only keeping this organization going, but growing it and sharing it with us. Oh, John, thank you. It's really, I mean this from my heart. It's truly an honor and a privilege to be on this journey with our community and with the people we serve and the people who partner with us to do this work. It is, it is truly magical to see what, the power of one person can make a difference in the life of another. And that kind of gift is what will transform our entire world. And that's what I want to be a part of. So thank you for helping get the word out about working wardrobes. And please consider this a formal invitation. We would love whoever you are, whatever gifts you have to bring to the table, whether it is the desire to rebuild your career or the desire to help share your talents and skills to help someone else do that. We welcome your, your partnership in this effort. Well, thank you. Bonnie, great to meet you. Thank you. Thank you both. And thank you both for your service to our community and our country. Have a wonderful day. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends, Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life.